Hey guys, I'm back for my second makeup tutorial. So today we're going to be doing a sort of blue, gold and black look. The gold doesn't really show up too much on the camera, but it does do a really nice effect. Um, this is probably one of my favourite combinations of colours. Um, black and gold and blue. I think it's a lovely combination so we'll get started. So today we're going to start off with, I have a palette here, I don't know who it's by but it's got some really nice, um, lots of different colours on it and today I'm going to be using this blue and just a little bit of this one. Um, it's a really vibrant blue in real life. Um, if you have a primer I would suggest using it um, to make the colour a bit brighter and help it stay on a bit longer. Um, but today I'll just be putting it on straight. Um, so yeah, I'll start putting it on. So this is a really nice evening look because it it is quite vibrant, vibrant. And if you have a black dress, this look would go really nice with it, really nicely. Make sure that you just put a little bit on it first, and then sort of blend it out. See how it looks. It's always good to have too little than too much. So after that, uh, it's a really quick look actually. All we need to do is line our top lash with some liquid liner. The same one I used last time um, by Catwalk. Just a, just a nice black, uh, here's a number, 150. So I'm just going to put that on. And kind of have it flick up just at the end and it creates a really nice contrast with your eyelashes and it also makes them look a bit thicker and a bit longer when you do it so I'm just gonna do that and I'll see you in a minute. Okay guys so we've got our eyeliner on um, and I've also lined the bottom lash in this designer brand it's just a black coal eyeliner um, and then I'm going to get this gold it's a gold by Revlon called Paralyzed Pure, Paralyzed Eyeliner it's number 6 gold flash Oops, and I'm going to put quite a bit of this on since it doesn't show up too much. I'm just going to put it underneath where I put that black eyeliner. It's a little bit just coming out from the inner corner. Which stands out in the corner. And I also want to put a bit on my waterline. Alright, so after that, 
I'm just going to highlight. I have a white here. It doesn't have a name. It's just a really shimmery, pure white colour. And I'm just going to put a bit of that in the inner corners. Wrap that in a bit. And I'm also going to use that as a highlight. So then we're just going to do lashes and we're done. I've got this really like this Inoxa Fuller Lash Mascara. Doesn't know what colour it is but it's a, it's a really nice one actually. It actually makes my eyelashes a lot bigger looking. So I'm just going to apply that to my upper and lower lashes. Again, you can curl your lashes. And also put false lashes on if you would like. So that's the eyes done there. Um, so if you were going to do this look, I would definitely um, go kind of neutral on the lips. Uh, I'd just have lip gloss by TBN. It's Ultra Snap Shine. Uh, I think I got this in a pack. This one's called Cherry Lip. And these ones actually smell quite nice. I already had a lip balm on them. Just, you know, just to help my lips stay kind of moist throughout the process. Um, so just use just a light sort of contour blush. Anyone that you want, just to bring out cheeks a little bit. You can put a bit of colour. It's just a apples on your cheeks. So that's my blue golden black tutorial. If you guys liked it, give me a like, comment if you'd like something in particular. And that's it. Alright, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.